Hello everyone. Hi chat, how's it going? Welcome everyone back to Train Sim World. We're going to be taking a look at a few more trains here today, mixing it up and doing uh, whatever we want, I suppose. We'll be hauling some cargo and some passengers today, so it should be a fun time. Hi chat, how's it going today? Hello everyone, good to see you here. What's up David and Steph, Ruggle, good to see you all here. Where's our sponsors? Any sponsors in chat? If you want to become a sponsor here today or to join in on the fun, make sure you tap or click that join button so you can support the stream, get access to those emotes. That would be fantastic. Please be sure to refrain from spamming the same question repetitively in chat. I'll just ignore those if it happens. So if you want to uh, definitely ask a question, feel free to drop a super chat. Otherwise, just be patient, and I'll try to get to you as soon as possible. It's good to have you all here. Welcome aboard, everyone. Nice to have you with us. If you haven't already, make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button so your name will pop up. And, of course, if you'd like to see more, make sure you go ahead and hit that like button, too. The reason we're back here today is because you showed amazing support yesterday. So let's have it, let's have it happen again today. Welcome, everyone. There's Austin. Austin Cole, one of our wonderful, fantastic sponsors. And welcome to all those new subscribers. Now, remember, if you have your subscription set to private so no one can see who you're subscribed to, your name won't pop up with your specific name. So make sure you set it to public. Well, without further ado, let's get into Train Sim World. then. We'll switch right over. To train sim world welcome to all of our new uh, subscribers and sponsors and super chatters today you're all fantastic welcome aboard everyone all right so i've got to admit uh while i went offline yesterday raptor uh he cheat i cheated a little bit i went and played more of this game because i couldn't get enough new of it so i played a little out. bit more brandon thank you very much for subscribing we're gonna go ahead and uh start with whatever you guys think would be a good thing here today uh new yesterday we did uh, a few csx trains and we did the tutorials for that and also tutorials for some british trains um, so we can continue on with some tutorials, we can continue on with some passenger service, or we can continue on with some cargo. If we do cargo, we can haul some uh, coal. So if you guys want, we could do a live uh, cargo load-up of coal, and then we can try to drive it around. Or we can do some um, aggregate in the United Kingdom. We can uh, even haul some cargo here, which I, I didn't even know. Uh, it's actually under the scenarios line. If we uh, haul that, we can do... Uh, some aggregate haul. Now, I'm not very good at this game, and I have a lot to learn, so it's going to definitely be a big learning experience here today. So uh, just bear with me if I, you know, make any massive mistakes or something like that. I I'm just learning. That's why it's a simulator. So luckily, there's no, um, you know, life-altering um, consequences if I make a mistake. So it's more New of a, a good learning out. program. Ruben, thank you very much for subscribing. Thank you very much for that. Rapid Transit passengers, passenger service. You guys want to see passengers today? Yeah, we can definitely do passengers for the United Kingdom, um, Germany, or the United States. And then actually, I think the... Uh, does the heavy haul have any sort of... Uh, I don't think it has any sort of passenger service, does it, on this line? No, it's all it's all cargo on this line, uh, which is... I forget exactly what the name of that one is. But actually, I think the uh, uh, Amtrak route, uh, the yeah, north Northeast Corridor, does have some cargo trains that we can haul. Yeah. There's a couple of cargo trains that we can haul this way. Trash collector. We can go pick up some trash, do whatever we want. So, All right, well, let's take a vote in chat. First of all, what do you guys want to start with today? Do you want to start with uh, tutorials or real-life scenarios? We can go through and learn how to drive the uh, German trains. We haven't done that yet. Or the American trains. So do you guys want to see scenarios or do you want to see uh, tutorials? Scenarios or tutorials? What do you guys think? What would be best? What do you want, chat? What should we do? I, I can't get enough of anything, so I'm, I'm, I have no votes. You guys... You guys pick. So scenario or tutorial? Of course, the tutorial will help us to walk through the train and figure out what to do exactly. Scenarios? Okay. All right. So we'll do a scenario. Do you guys want to see a passenger train service or a more cargo? We could load up some. Uh, we could load up some coal, or we could haul some uh, trash trailers around. Which I don't know if that means that they're filled with actual garbage or if it's a slang term for if they're not full. What do you guys think? And again, I'm not. Uh, we're not voting on where first. We're we're first fir figuring out where we're doing. Then we're gonna figure out w what we're doing. Cargo. Okay. What do you guys think? Do you guys think we should do cargo in the United Kingdom, in uh, New York, or uh, or uh, I think this is just coal. Actually, is there anything else we can haul here? Let me see. Um. Oh yeah, there's coal. And then there's some other cargo. What do you guys think? Should we do coal or aggregate? Should we do a British train or American train? What do you guys think? We're going to hit them all eventually, but we'll figure... Do you guys want to do New York? You guys are thinking New York would be cool? Okay. What do we have in New York? New York does allow us to haul... Uh, let's take a look at the scenarios. Uh, let's see. Operate a manifest train from Fresh Pond Junction to Oak Point Yard. So that one's probably got 
something with it. Trash collector. Starting out at Oak Point, run some trash empties out to Harlem Dude, Terminal and drop them off shadow. before hauling a loaded cutback or free switching in the yards in New York. I think, actually, I think the last one, I think I think this is just you being able to do whatever you want. I think it's the last one. All right, do you guys think we should do uh, heavy uh, CSX? Uh, I guess we'll just call it heavy haul scenario or New York. I think I like these New York scenarios. These are kind of cool. Let's start with one of these. Let's do this one here. Uh, starting out at Oak Point Yard, run some trash empties out to Harlem Terminal and drop them off before hauling a loaded cutback. Or we could do terminal switch. Uh, let's see, what is that? Boxcar over to Hunt once. Bring back a... Oh, well, this one allows... Take uh, boxcars over to Hunt's Point, and then once there, bring back mixed cars. Hmm. All right, we'll do the heavy haul next. Let's start with New York. I like this one that literally just called Trash Collector. I don't think we have to go too far, so let's go ahead and see what this has to offer us. Well, welcome, everybody. Welcome to those new subscribers. You guys are great. Again, if you want to join in on the fun for any multiplayer, make sure you tap that join button. Click or tap that join button, and your name should pop up here if you become a uh, supporter here. All right. There's going to be a mission briefing, I think, and uh, we'll see how well we do. Ooh, it's already loaded. Oh, look at that train. That is huge. That is one long train. Is there no, no voice acting here? There's no voice acting. Uh, bring out the loaded cut towards the... Oh, usually there's voice acting on these. All right, well, I guess let's hop in the... Uh, I believe this is called a Buick. No. It's not. I'm just teasing. Oh, we can't get in through this way. There we go. So what we're going to do is we'll do this one first, and then we'll go do uh, coal, I think, in the other one. We'll see. Oh, this is a way different train. This is not as uh, optimized as that other one. I didn't even see that guy sitting there. I, I guess he doesn't want to look at us. Elsie, thank you very much for subscribing. All right, so what's our goal now? Flipper into... F oh, uh, set the reverse into forward and sound the horn. All right, roger. All right, so it says uh, Harlem Terminal Entrance, roger. All right, we're proceeding forward. So I think these are... Are these loaded with trash? I'm not sure. Yeah, oh, this could be dumpsters. Wow, look at that. All that trash going out of New York City. That is amazing, guys. Look at that. Yeah, make sure you wave at the train, folks. How many cars do you guys think this thing has? Can anyone count? Look at how long that is. Oh, we get to go under the highway? Oh, that looks amazing. Look at that. Watch the switches? Uh, I'm not even sure. You know, that's one thing that the game needs to do a little bit more is uh, teaching a noob like me exactly how to, uh, like, look out for, uh, you know, switch changes and stuff like that. I guess we'll, uh, I guess we'll just have to learn as we go along. Uh, Leg Nation, thanks for the $2, my man. Appreciate that. Oh, there goes an Amtrak uh, American commuter train. Thank you again for your support. And yeah, we did already blow the horn. We're not supposed to blow it more than twice. Press 9 to see the switches. Uh... I don't even know where we're going. Oh, I don't I don't know how to read that type of map. Uh-oh, we're speeding too. Slow it down there. And we'll just uh, pay attention and see if we can make it there in one piece. I think these are some of the initial um, missions as well, so it shouldn't be overly complicated. Go ahead and take a look here. And Is there anything we have to switch? Oh, we should be on the right track then, right? Well, this one's pointed uh, back our way. I guess I'll have to learn how it goes. I'm the best YouTuber ever. Well, thank you very much, Maze Extremes Games. Appreciate that. I, I'm not the best uh, gamer for sure, but at least I put on a uh, good time. Wow, look at that. We're, like, going down underneath. Look at the, how detailed that. Whoa, cool. Other trains are zipping by all the time. Awesome, man. We're going 
going downhill a little bit, so she's going to definitely speed up. I uh, suppose we'll just do a little initial reduction here. There we go. I think all we need to do is keep her in a straight line. Beautiful going down here. Maze, thank you for the one again. Open the window. Okay. Woo! Check that out. Look, we can even uh, pull the blind down. Isn't that cool? So detailed in this thing. We can even put the visor down. Pretty amazing. That thing's as big as like a drive through window at a fast food restaurant, you know? Yeah, City Skylines will be on the weekend. So now, and I'm not sure how to read these uh, signals. Now, we should be going to the right. Okay, we're not. All right, so we got to stop then. Are we going the right way? Hold on. Oh, no, we're going the right way. My bad. Sorry, I was... Lack of confidence is I'm not sure exactly. I suppose as I run these routes more, I'll know exactly where we're going and what tracks lead where, as a, a seasoned veteran would. Uh, we don't want to go faster. We want to keep it under 15 miles per hour. That's the rules and regulation on this section of track. Same with not blowing the horn repeatedly or doing anything unnecessary or, uh, I guess, otherwise illegal. We'll be stopping at about 350 yards which at the uh, speed of like 15 miles an hour ain't that ain't that big of a deal. Practice will make perfect though. We need a round of applause when I complete a mission. <laughs> yeah. Or just each uh, individual uh, objective. It's pretty good so far. That is a lot. Man, this is so cool. I love the the graphical style of this. This really feels like if ATS and Euro Truck came together and made a train game, this would have been it. I'm really impressed with this game. So this thing really comes to a stop. Once you hit about like three miles per hour, she pretty much like goes uh, like five, four, three, zero. And like just immediately abruptly stops. Okay, we're at eight. Seven, six. Now watch this. We're at three. Oh, wow. This one's way smoother than the other train. Never mind. This one's pretty gradual. Good. Assuming we put it in full service now. And Set the track switches to gain access to track one. Okay. Do, 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 do. Uh, which way is that? Up there? Oh, wait a minute, what? Ooh, that looks cool, doesn't that? That's amazing. All right, let's take a look at the map. All right, we're on foot. Gain tra access to track one. How do I know which one's track one? Okay, so that's the far right track. We just need to follow it back here. So we want this to cut to the left, then. Oh, you can switch the... You can. You don't have to get out to flip it? You can do it in free cam? Really? Uh-oh. Why are there two switches here? Oh, that's going that way. Okay. Okay, did I do this right? Is this going to go this way? Because I needed to go to the next one. Oh, you can click on the map to change it? Oh, that's cool. I didn't know that. I thought we had to get out every time. So you can just do it that way? Hold on a second. <gasps> you can't? Wait, no, you can't. 
Left click, switch lever. Oh, it's not letting me do it. Hmm. Well, if you crash into a train or something quickly, it just basically says you did... Nothing really amazing happens. It just... You just hit it, and it's just like, you did something bad. And then it ends. All right, did I set that track right, everybody? Is that good? All right, let's hop back inside. We'll see. A uh, little bit of practice. Uh, okay, let's take a look at the map again. I don't know how you would set this one properly. Seems like that's where we're going, though. Okay. Oops, got a foot error in fur. Wait a minute. Oh, I'm hitting the wrong button. There we go. My hand was in the wrong place at the keyboard. Okay. I'm getting conflicting uh, responses from chat, so I guess we'll just have to see how it works out. Now I flipped the one in the front rather than the one in the back, because I think the one in the back goes the opposite way. But if we go left, then we did it right. Which we did. Yay! So we're going to pull up between all these other cars, I guess. Do, 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 do. There we go. So we're just going to come pulling in here, and this should be it. Look at all the trash cars here. This is crazy. There's so much... Uh, I think each one of these trash cars is uh, containing the comment to somebody in chat who didn't know what they were talking about. Raptor, you got—you know what you got to do, Raptor. You got to use. Okay, what you need to do is you need to flip. Okay, the okay. You got to hit seven on the keyboard, and then you got to go to your microwave and put it on six minutes, and then you got. Okay, what you need to do is get a fork and a spoon, and you need to put them in the garbage disposal. Even when I did it right, chat's like, no, it's totally, it's totally wrong. Yeah, chat, we did it right. Look, the goal is literally right in front of us. All right, now we're going to put her on initial reduction, and that's going to be it. We did it right. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. There we go. Alright, it's so coming to a full stop just under the bridge. Hey, not too bad. Stop right on the two locomotives. That's a tough target to hit, man. Perfect. On couple vehicles, 15. Okay. Let's put this back into neutral. All right. Time to break up some couples. Uh, we better go this way. Do, 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 Okay, let's see. Uh, a couple of things I have to remember to do. Oh, why is it so dark all of a sudden? What? Is it because of the bridge? It, like, got super dark all of a sudden. That was weird. All right, uh, let's see. We have to, uh, do something... Wait a minute, isn't there a wheel to lock this stuff? Actually, I don't remember how to properly lock these. There's our... Coupler there and there. 
All right, let's pull back up top. Oh, there we go. Wait a minute. Oh, that's all I had to do? Why was it red then? It made me think I was doing it wrong. Uh, David, go ahead and stop the uh, back seating, man. Just relax and enjoy the show. Thank you. You've been misleading about nine times out of ten, so just, just enjoy the show. I'm here to stream for a bunch of people. So don't interrupt, don't interrupt them. Just relax. Okay, let's go ahead and hop in the seat. And roll forward. So now I think we pick up something else. Oh, now we're rolling forward with power. Well, thank you, Joshua. Yes, thank you for being here, chat. Oh, wait a minute. Are we going left? Yes. Good. I've gotten way better with driving these trains. Just like in the ATS and Euro Truck, though, it's much more difficult to drive a vehicle that is emptied of cargo <laughs> than it is when it's, like, uh, full. Because you stop on a dime, you accelerate on a dime, everything's, like, instantaneous. Let's just go ahead and put it in full service here. There we go. Oh, all right. So we just, uh, I guess we just pulled over. Let's take a look around and see where exactly we're at. All right, throw our neutral and uh, set automatic automatic brake handle to off. Oop, there we go. And cut out. There we go. All right, let's see if we can look at this thing. Wait, where's the? Uh, I won't, let, I won't let me look at that. Trail six. Okay. Decided to be controlled from another unit. That's, wait a minute, hold on. That's weird. It doesn't say exactly which one. Oh, okay. Switch off radio fuse. Move to the rear locomotive cab for return trip. Now we're going the opposite way. Yes, yeah, so we'll be getting a uh, farming simulator when it comes out for the new one. Oh, wrong side. I forget this one's opposite because we're on the other side now. Yeah, if you want to uh, spam emojis, feel free if you're using those uh, Rat Pack emotes. All you gotta do is click or tap that sponsor button and you can become, uh, or it literally just says join. So join us for the fun. Okay. Oh. Well, why would you make me sit down first? Jeez. Alright, radio fuse. Long hood end. Alright, what do we got here? Engine on. Generator field on. Pump on. Lights to bright. Ditch lights on, gauge lights on, valve to lead, freight, 
apply independent brake to 30. Release. Raise brake pipe to 75. What the? Okay, I think we're ready for takeoff. Checking the line, any track switches in order to reach the terminal entrance again for return trip. Oh, so now we just got to go back and make sure the tracks are set correctly. Okay. Where exactly are we going? Now, for whatever reason, chat was saying, like, you can do that, but... All right, so we got to get... We basically got to get out and switch that one. Also, you guys were saying I could do it from free cam, but I don't know about that. Okay, that seems correct. Ooh, wait a minute, there it is. Yeah, we don't want to go into that train. Uh, that seems incorrect. Where do we switch the next one? Wait a minute. Oh. Okay. That's correct. Oh, okay, that's all we had to do. All right, we're going to go ahead and deal with this. Sorry about that, chat. We're going to go ahead and make the experience a little bit better quality for you. Do, 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 do. And again, if you guys are liking this today and would like to see more of uh, CSX Heavy Haul or Train Sim World, make sure you go ahead and hit that like button and let me know you'd like to see more. Good to have you all here. Uh, using all the DLCs, I guess, that are available. But right now we're just on the CSX. No, actually, we're on the uh, Northeast uh, Corridor. Franco, thank you very much for subscribing. Welcome aboard. All right, we're ready to roll. left here we did it correctly yes we did New subscriber shout out. thank you everyone for subscribing yeah, this game has beautiful graphics, and uh, it's just really fun to play. This is um, not tedious. It's not boring. It, I'm engaged. I like. I like. <laughs> I actually really like driving the train through all these, uh, you know, ter t terminal. Uh, you know, driving back to the terminal and going through switchbacks and stuff. Can I do episodes on this game? Yeah. If you guys show enough support to stuff, that's why. I, if I do something you really, really like, make sure you let me know by like literally tapping the like button, so that way I know that you want to see more of it. We're going to play this again tomorrow, too, so but don't worry. We're just getting started now. I think next we're going to do a uh, a British train. Uh, no, if we went right, we would have crashed into that other train that was to our right. You see these giant cars here on our right side? All those cars there, that's to our right. I wanted to go left, which is on this track. And thus we did it correctly, like I said. 
It should be fine all the all the way back. Our train is here. The blue line is where we're going. The purples is is for intersections, which we're following the correct one. And it should we just have to stop right there, which is correct. There's more DLC. I might pick that one up then. Uh, there's a British uh, aggregate train, a cargo train that you can haul. So there, there is a freight uh, type train that you can haul. There's also an American coal cargo uh, train. You guys want to see me load coal or haul aggregate next? You want to see a load or a haul? What do you guys want to see? Yeah, the train really looks... I mean, it really looks good. I mean, I, I couldn't imagine it being much, much more detailed than this. They did a very good job. All right, what do you guys think? Uh, load or haul next? All right, we're coming up to our stop. Hey, Corey P. Good to have me on the big screen, then. Welcome. Now, it's always hard stopping these unloaded trains. I can could, I could never master this one. Load or haul? Oh, it feels like 50-50. I can't tell. Oh. oh, it just speeds up and slows down so quickly, unloaded. But we made it to our goal. All right, let's go ahead and throw her on to full service. Maybe a little bit of a quick stop, but we made it. Yay! Uh, now what? Set the track switches again to cross the cars onto track two. Uh, oh, they want us to go pick up. Oh, I see. They want us to haul from there. I got you. Okay. All right. I got you. Do, 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 do. I love I love when you can hear the train get louder when you get outside. It's really cool. Yeah, Pinto, it's a very cool game. I played it yesterday. We can actually go on German passenger trains, British passenger trains, British freight trains, American freight, and also uh, the Northeast Corridor as well. So uh, there's, a, there's a lot we can do. I think we should do an American passenger train next, but may, maybe we'll do some more cargo just so chat's happy, but we'll, we'll see here. All right, I need to get my bearings and find out where exactly we're going. I think we just need to flip this one once, but let's just make sure. The map The map is actually made... It's very easy to read the map. All right, so what we're doing is we're here. We need to go back this direction. Okay, so we just need to flip this one. So we got to go back to... We're not even on that track. Well, we won't be. Actually, wait a minute. Are we? No. We need to flip this one then to go to the right. Freight is coming to Germany. That's going to be awesome. I'm totally down to play more of this game. All right, let me make absolutely sure. First of all, no, don't stand on the track. Second of all, let's make sure we got it right. Triple checking is probably a good thing for me at this moment. Okay, looks like it's correct, and then we'll grab these cars. So we're gonna. So what we're doing essentially is we're working for the state of New York or the city of New York, and we're hauling, uh, f like trash. Uh, freight cars back and forth. They, they're full of trash, and so we're dropping them off and moving them to where they need to be. I'll take votes on what we do next, but I think the next thing we're going to do is uh, load up with coal, which I don't think is going to be too exciting, but you guys wanted to see it, but I'll ask again in a little bit just to make sure. We'll go through everything and see what everybody wants to do, but first got to finish this job. Okay, so now... Actually, wait, am I, aren't I in the wrong train? Because aren't we supposed to be in the other car if we're going in reverse? I guess not. Okay, let's back her up. Uh, let's see. Throw her in reverse. Do we honk three times for reverse? I don't. I don't know the rules exactly yet, but we're learning. So long as we've done everything right, we should end up going all the way back. Uh, we're gonna basically take a left and then go off the. Oh, this is gonna be confusing.
Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh, wait a minute. I don't know if I set the right one. Hold on. Wait a minute. Yeah, this is right. Yeah, we're going to couple with this uh, car right here. Yeah, dude, David, you've been incorrect on every single one of your back seats, dude. I know I'm right when you say, hey, man, you got, hey, you're wrong, man. Just relax, man. Don't commentate. Just, re just relax and enjoy. All right, now I got, got a complete reversing. Bob is on the other side. Bob's in the other train, yeah. All right. We're going to go ahead and smash in here. Eh, you want to hit it at about five miles an hour. That's that's what we learned during our training. So so long as we're under five, we're okay. Yeah, I'm not trying to point people out. I'm just saying, like, don't backseat when you're wrong. All right, just got to wait for the train to come to a stop now. Okay, now we just uh, roll ahead to our next destination, which is Oak uh, Point Park. Is that what it's called? All right, we better make sure the track's set up correctly. I haven't been wrong so far. I'm really blowing myself out of the water here. My mind just just, blow, just blowing my mind here. Well, this looks correct. Yep. So the light te the teal line is where we're going. All other red lines we cannot cross onto. We're not permitted to go there. Oh, okay, so it's all uh, safe sailing. Released. Okay, go ahead. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. Now I did something wrong. You didn't see anything. <laughs> you know, actually, I like driving this train model a lot better than the other ones where it's just the console in front of you. Because um, this one... Yeah, I like how the throttle and the uh, reverser are right next to each other on the... I forget what the other name of the, the other train is, but... Um, I, like, I forget the designation, but basically it's got a con like a, a desk in front of it. And I like, the, I like this better. This is my preferred one, but... Anyway. However, the other trains do have computers that uh, set cruise control. This one you got to kind of do it by flipping it back, throttled back and forth. So long as we keep it under 15 miles an hour, we're good. Yes, Chad, you are right. Uh, crossings are too long, one short, and one long again. But I don't think we'll be seeing any road crossings here. Most uh, road crossings in this one go over the top. Dude, this is really cool. This is this has already taken us about like 40 minutes. This is nice. Uh, the AC4400 has the desk, and that's an EMD GP42. Wow. Some of you guys are, like, pro, like beyond pros. That's awesome. Train look cool, me like, is basically uh, the extent of Raptor's thinking. Yeah, we're not permitted to go over 15 miles an hour in the yard. The key really is to watch amperage and to make sure your uh, make sure your amps don't get too high when you're uh, just rolling slow. Do I like sushi? I guess, yeah. Yeah, the uh, fastest train I think you can go in is the British, uh, or at least the fastest I've gotten yet, is the British um, Great Ro uh, Great Western, and uh, I've gone up to 125 with that. But that was just through practice. I think me practicing offline was pretty good because I got a little bit more confident with my train skills. I'm not perfect, but at least I did all the switching correct so far, anyway. But now the next goal is to find out... Uh, you know, when we're going a long distance, when I have to pull over and wait for other trains, go on junctions and bypasses, that type of thing. 
Why do I have to live in the middle of the night? Uh, because I'm a creature of the night. If I go out in the day, my skin will burn. Oh no, that's vampires. Never mind. Alright, we're about a thousand yards away from our uh, de final destination here. I think we're going uphill now. So we could probably give her a little bit more juice in the next... Uh, We're just working with waste management right now. Really do like the uh, freight train here in the beautiful city of, uh, or state of New York. All right, everybody, thank you very much for subscribing too, by the way. Folks, if you haven't already, make sure you go ahead and hit that uh, subscribe button so your name pops up and join us. You're all welcome aboard, so go ahead and hit that button. Let me know. If you want to see more, too. Yeah, this is a... You know what? This is way more relaxing than, like, uh, eight... You know, I think tri uh, pl flight simulators are, like, super, super relaxing. Because once you've taxied onto the runway, and once you've taken off, and once you've uh, hit cruising out. altitude, you can kind of go mindless, almost. But um, the nice thing about these games is that they're, it, it's a little bit trucking simulator. It's a little bit flight simulator. When you're in the yard, it's almost like you're on the runway. And uh, when you're when you're on the train on the high speed rails, you gotta really watch things as if you were a truck. Okay, we're about 400 yards away. I'll start slowing things down here in just a minute. All right, what do you guys think we should do next? I think we're almost done with this job. Should we load some coal or should we haul some aggregate? Or sh should we do something with passengers? We don't have to do cargo. We're, we're already doing cargo now. Doing some big old cargo there. All right, let's go ahead and initiate braking procedure. Yeah, we could load coal. We could do a American passenger train. We can do a British passenger train. We could hit a high speed. Do you guys want to do a high speed passenger train, or should we do like a commuter train where we, where we stop and go? You guys want to do like the fast speed one, or because we could do a high speed British train, but we could do American too. Oh, I don't know. There's so much to do. I can't even. I can't even make up my mind. All right, let's in initial reduction and. Let's bring her to a stop. All right. And we're here. Perfect. All right, what next? Welcome back to Oak Point Yard. Place the cars on track five. Check for correct s switch position before entering. Okay. Wait, that's the other way. All right, track five is to the right. Correct. That is correct. Incorrect. I can't seem to be able to switch that one. Somebody was saying I can go into external camera though to do this. I don't. I don't know if I believe him. Let's try. All right. So if we get out of the train, the one we have to switch, I think, is. Uh, way up here, boy. We got to go a long distance. Track five is this one on the. Whew, that is a long distance. Can we actually switch these? Oh, you can. Can you do that? You can? Oh, that's so nice. I didn't know you, you could avoid getting out. That's cool. Uh, let's uh, go back then and take a look at which one it is. That's cool. Although you got to be ex exactly uh, correct if you're going to switch it from this camera because you can't tell where you're standing. So it should be... 
this track here. So let's see if we're right now. Okay, looks correct. Wow, I didn't know you could do that. Well, that saves us some time. Okay, here we go. I think that's correct. So that's a nice time save, at least, the external camera. That's something I didn't know about before. But it also, it doesn't hurt to get out of the train and walk it in real life either for a more realistic experience. Well, thank you, Hannah. Yeah, I'm, I'm the best at flipping switches, I guess. Please go faster. Well, we're not permitted to go above uh, 15. If you want to see faster, we're going to do fast in the uh, next episode here. We're going to, as soon as we're done here, I think we're going to go on the... All right, so we've, I think we've decided passenger train. <clears throat> now, do you guys want to see an American passenger train or a high-speed British train? Do you want top speed or America? Which one do you like better? And we'll probably do them both. But which one do you want to see first? You want to see, like, a 125-mile-an-hour train or uh, an American uh, commuter train? Wait a minute. This is the wrong track, isn't it? Yep. I missed this one. Hold on. Well, there we go. Now I got a wrong one. New subscriber shout out. All right, David. Thanks for subbing. Okay, so we need to be on this track here. Wait a minute, was I... Oh, yeah, see, that's why I didn't want to be on the... Actually, wait a minute. That doesn't make sense. That marker... Hold on a second. Let's back it up for a minute. This marker here... Oh, is this one indicating to the right? Okay, I may have I may have missed one. There are so many here, though. Look at that. There's like three of them right in the same spot. Let me back up, back up enough to see it. Okay. There is one switcher. Okay. I think I've done quite well for not uh, doing this before and not knowing anything about switches or how to read the game's map. So I don't. I don't think there's any. Uh oh, it does switch this way, doesn't it? Okay, we're good. Sweet. So now we'll get to go on to do our uh, British train next, I think. I think everybody wanted to see high speed. Wait a minute, didn't I click that? Hold on a second. Well, I know I clicked it to change it. Hold on a second, that's a little... Uh, are we on the right track now? What's? Well, now we're on the right track, but it looked like it was going the wrong way again. Oh, jeez. Well, now we're on the correct track, so so all we got to do is park right down here on this blue line at the end. All right. Well, there we go. Jeez. Now we're just going to pull in here, and now we're good. I guess I was just getting used to ex changing the camera from the uh, external camera view or the map. Amtrak? Well, I think everybody wants to see a high-speed train next, so I think we're going to do high-speed. That's what we're going to do next. And then we can come back and do an Amtrak one from the uh, Newark Liberty uh, Airport to... Uh, I forget what the next stop on that line is, but we'll do it. You know what would be really cool 
is uh, in this game, if you were able to get money from doing this and then you were able to customize some stuff in your train, it'd be nice to put up like a poster or something, you know, hanging on the side of the cab or something like that. That'd be fun. All right, we're almost to our destination. Not too bad. I've definitely learned a lot about switches. That'll be very helpful in the future. The thing I need to really learn about now is to, uh, while, we're, while we're driving the trains, to make sure, uh, for example, if we need to use a, a bypass or a, you know, switch a junction or something like that, that we're on the right uh, track and we're doing the right speed. And that's going to be, this low speed moving cargo stuff is uh, pretty enjoyable, but it's going to get a little bit more challenging as we go on. Believe it or not, this is actually how us YouTubers uh, upload our videos too. We don't actually um, upload anything to the internet. We have to ship it to YouTube, like via train, because some of our videos are so so big. So this is actually like a, a whole week's worth of videos coming in. That's why mine are all in trash containers. Thank you. Thank you, chat. Okay, we're almost there. So I think we're going to do a uh, high-speed British train next. And then we'll do an Amtrak train after that. We'll mix it up with a little bit of British just to get a feel of uh, different things. We'll get America in there too. That's our theme today. But I don't want to just simply do America. There's other trains out there. Right, we should have stopped braking a little while ago. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. There we go. I probably should have been back a little bit, but that's all right. Duty complete. Climb down from the locomotive. All right. What the heck? Oh, let's go down the other way. Oh, that was weird. Do, 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 do. There she is. We did it. Yay! All right, chat. Round of applause. All right. Not too bad. Oh, and that was called the GP38Y... Or, sorry, the GP382YN3. NEC New York. Well, we, we walked about a half... Oh, you get XP for walking, too. <laughs> well, I may as well get out and walk the train, then. You get bonus points for it. Very nice. Very, very nice. Okay. So, we have completed... Uh, let's go to the main menu for this one. Let's take a look at the scenarios we've completed. I think I've completed all the tutorials, except for, like, for the Germans. So, let's take a look at the scenarios we've completed so far. So, Trash Collector is completed. Um, and I think we've done one of the... Uh, Coal ones as well. <sighs> Let's see. Okay, Great Western Express. So you guys want to do a high-speed train? I think the one here is the uh, Christmas closures. I think we can get up to 125. It's the Christmas holidays and the network rail has closed. London Paddington is part of the uh, cross rail construction program. Trains are being turned back at Elling, Elian, uh, Broadway. Very nice. Hmm. Oh, and here's the aggregate industry uh, discharge. Okay. Oh, I don't know. I kind of want to do some American stuff. Though. Let's take a look at the American stuff. I can never decide. that There's too many options. That's the problem. Uh, let's take a look at the American scenarios. City Sprinter. Uh, take to the controls of a train at Newark Liberty International Airport and operate it... Uh, through to New York Penn Station. Uh, let's see. Well, this is essentially the same thing, just longer. Trash collector, we did that one. All right, well, let's do an American train, shall we? Let's do one American train, then let's work our way up to the high-speed British. Now, I will already give you a forewarning for those of you in chat expecting to see professionalism and me stopping on time and driving this train perfectly. Uh, that's not going to happen, so you can, you can uh, go ahead and... Uh, <laughs> go somewhere else right now to find someone to drive it right because I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be able to do this perfectly I'm not gonna be able to stop at the stations I'm 
Probably going to goof it up, but this is this is practice. This is practice. So, an American City Sprinter. We're in an Amtrak train now, otherwise known as American uh, Track. That's There you go. That's an Amtrak train right there. Beautiful. All right, let's see what our objectives are. Welcome to New York Liberty International Airport. We'll be taking control of an Amtrak 170 through to New York Penn Station. Oh, here comes a train now. Head over to track one. All right. Love the electric trains. Well, if I hit somebody walking on the tracks, that's not my fault. They're not. Those are restricted areas. You can't be out there. Sir, good evening. Morning, I mean. Okay, so we're going to walk across the other side. Ma'am, good morning. The Rock, I love your movies. Thank you. Bum, 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 bum. All right, so we're on track one, track A. What's the difference between that? Sit in the engineer's seat at the lead locomotive. Ooh, fancy. Sit in the engineer's seat. Boom. Objective complete. All right, unlock doors. Now, I know we can do with this with the tab button. So we're going to have to unlock the uh, seats on the right. I don't know where actually where the button is on this one, though, for unlock. Does anyone know where the uh, door unlock is on the console? What do you think? All right, now we can uh, lock doors. All right, so all passengers are on board. Set reverser to forward. Objective complete. Disengage brake. Release. Uh, apply power. 55%. Actually, aren't we supposed to blow the horn? I should give us extra points for doing that. What the? Ah, yeah, whatever. Oh, hi, Pinto. All right, so we got 2.4 miles to go to our next destination. We're authorized to proceed at 90 miles per hour. We'll go ahead and do so then. Master control to max. Current limitations at 90. Oh, we're already doing 35. Seems like we're going a lot faster from outside, doesn't it? Inside the train, it just seems like we're doing like 10 or 15. Newark Penn Station at 7.05. So practice will make perfect with my braking. So we will see how well we do it here. Ooh, we're leaning into a turn. Nice. Very beautiful looking train. I'm glad they have realistic trains in this one, and I'm glad it looks so well, uh, very, very good. It's a really well done uh, game. This is one I'm happy to to have a, with me, I guess. So we're just gonna coast, I guess, for the next mile. Yeah, the bell automatically goes on when we sound the horn, and then it just has to be turned off as we are away from the station. As to when you're supposed to turn it off, I guess there could be some debate. Okay, we're one mile out from the station. Is there a multiplayer? I don't think so, but I really would love to see that. I think this would be a great game to play with a friend. At least you could sit in the same train and, you know, just chat, I suppose. Okay, we're coming up to our, uh, our stop. 
Oh yeah, I'm already going way over the speed. It's going to take some practice, but I already told you. Don't expect much from me. Oh, this, this train actually, uh, when you get it under like 20 miles an hour, comes right to a stop. Well, thank you very much, Reese. And thank you, everyone, for clicking or tapping that subscribe button. If you do that, magic happens here on the stream. Your name will pop up, and uh, I'll give you a shout-out then for joining the fun. Okay, I'm going to have to get a little pra I'll need some practice with passenger trains, but this game is perfect for practice. There's a lot of... Um, it's user friendly for people who don't know. I'm not I'm I'm not, I'm not a person who drives a train in real life and I'd probably say 99% of the people watching have never been in a uh, locomotive let alone the uh, controlling section of it. So it's a good experience for all of us. What's the button that controls the oh, I stopped way too short. What's the button that controls the brakes on the keyboard? That'll be a little easier to drive that way. I'll have to find that button. Sound the bell? Do I have to do that when we're pulling in? Okay. Now we'll just coast in. Oh, I also can use this for the braking too, the uh, master control. That's one thing I gotta remember too, is electric trains are a little different than the diesel we just drove. There we go. Seven oh five. Eh, we're fifteen seconds late. In Japan, that would be unacceptable. Wait a minute. Eight yards. Wait, did I not? Oh, I'm just still a little short. Oh, my mistake. I thought we were right on top of it. Do do do. Passenger trains are gonna. Yeah, you gotta you gotta stop perfectly with those trains. Won't let you donate. Well, there there is a PayPal uh, down below if you want to uh, use that. There's also a uh, super chat down there too. But regardless, you can become a sponsor too if you'd like to. Sorry, I was uh, like seven yards off. <laughs> Steam train? That would be cool. I, I think there is a uh, way to do that. Why are we moving so slow with no braking? Well, now we're a minute behind. I stopped at the station. Why does it not... Wait, now we're two yards off? One yard off. Wait, that's confusing. One, two. How do I know if I'm at the station or not? Well, technically, I'm supposed to stop up there, aren't I? Hold on a second. The whole train's not even in here. Wait a minute. That's really confusing to, to me. Like, are we... We're not even in the station. Is this where the rear car is supposed to stop, or what? Hmm. Oh, boy, there's going to be a lot of mad people this morning. <laughs> oh, that has to be the back of the train stopping? Hmm. Okay. So I think... I've done passenger train tutorials with the UK train before, but it didn't necessarily explain... Oh... Uh, everything exactly. Brakes are all released, too. Why is it... Oh, because the doors are open. Uh, we're using the Amtrak train. Uh, it's the uh, Amtrak 170, I believe. Oh, wait. Now it's objective complete? What the... I rolled forward a, like... What? I rolled forward like a, a cat hair's width forward. Oh, my goodness. I guess this will take training, won't it? Now we're moving again. All right. All right, so braking in this game, there's, like, no joke. Like, you got to be a Japanese train driver, like, day one. But that's confusing because, look, the the train, the full train's not even on the, 
They wanted me to stop there, but one car is totally not even at the station. Like, I guess, I guess technically only the front door has to be there. But, yeah, okay. Well, this is just practice. Now, if I've been playing this game for three months and I'm still making these mistakes, then you guys can be like, "What's he? what are you doing? But for now, you gotta give me a little break. All right. Why doesn't even the horn work? Oh, there we go. All right. Well, that's gonna have to be the end of that. Oh, didn't mean to do that. You, would, God, dude. Sorry, folks, I was having to deal with some narcissism there. Just give me a second. Do, do, do. All right, there we go. Sorry, I didn't have control of the train for a second. There we go. Yeah, this game is very nice. Alright, so that was our first practice stop. I've done way better than that, but sometimes the game's prompts kind of confuse me. At least for stopping at stations. That's that's going to be my biggest thing to worry about. Junctions and uh, stopping at stations. Also, Lord Siberia. Sorry about that. I will uh, undo that soon. I was trying to zap someone else, and I accidentally zapped you. My mistake. So, Gage, in the time that you've asked that question three or four times, I think you could do the research on it. Graphics are absolutely beautiful. Absolutely. We're actually going very fast in this train. We are really going fast on the outside. We're definitely making good time. I like when we get to uh, actually do the uh, setup of the train. Second time you've said that message. Guys, in chat, uh, moderators, we're going to go ahead and start timing out people who just uh, copy-paste the same message. Chat, guys, if I don't read your uh, question or respond to you, that's just going to happen. I can't get to everybody, and it's just kind of like, it just, it's just spam. Don't, don't do that. No one likes spam. So just <sighs> take a deep breath and come along for the train ride. It's going to be a good one. Can you do a night mode? I bet you can. Right now we're driving in the morning. I think there is a nighttime one. Doing good there, Patty. How are you? Welcome. So I think this means that we need to slow down to prepare to stop. What's up, Aubrey? Train's top speed, probably near 120. I'm not doing this. I'm not going so fast now because I think we actually have to stop in about 900 feet or so. I think we have to wait for another train to come by. 150 is its top speed? I don't think it can go that fast. Subscriber shout out. 
Kao, thank you very, very much for subscribing. Okay, so... I think we can just keep on rolling here. It's nice to hear this train. Pretty cool bridge. Okay, so I think we're, we're getting ready to stop. I just don't know where or when, so I'm just being cautious. New subscriber shout out. Call sign space, thank you for subscribing. Welcome. Oh. I think the next is actually the stop. Okay. Syracuse at seven thirteen. Oh, we're behind. Yeah, I just don't want to get in an accident or do anything uh, crazy. We might be free to go through to stations, so. Bum, 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 bum. We'll just use the emergency brake till I get used to it. There we go. Open doors left. Use dynamic braking. Is that better for stopping at stations? Oh, wait a minute. We have independent brake. Automatic brake. Mm hmm. Do, 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 do. Have I tried to use B for brakes? That's for the bell. This actually sounds like when you get a right answer on Family Feud. Jessica, name two things in the kitchen that you can throw away. Oh my god. Uh, napkins? Alright. Survey says? Napkins! Alright, Jessica. Congratulations. The Pina Colada family moves on to the next round. Alright, let's go. Ready? Okay, and disengage. What? That's how it works. What? That's how it works, chat. Haven't you guys ever seen Family Feud before? Ooh, we have to get to the next station in about 10 minutes, so hopefully we get to go through it, like, top speed. Speed limit here is, uh... What, 40? Okay. I don't know how many stations are here. This this will be our third one up ahead. I don't know if it's that far up ahead. They want us to continue at a slow speed, so I'm just going to kind of chill at this speed for a second. Oh, the next one's 3.9 miles away. Okay, we should be okay to go full speed. Or at least close enough. I'm starting to understand the markers a lot more, junctions, uh, symbols, that type of thing. So that's kind of a, a good thing. Looks like we're slowing down here. Oh, sh yeah, we're supposed to stop there. Okay, well, there you go. That's the fail.
So that's what's uh, kind of confusing is that I, I'm, I'm sometimes I'm not sure where you have to stop or whatnot. I wish they would make that a part of the objective rather than just like me knowing that. Because again, still I'm not sure like how long am I waiting there for? You know, how long do I wait? Why do I wait? Like, what's the reasoning? Teach me. Teach me. Okay, let's go on to a new scenario. Let's go on to uh, should we do British trains next? Or we could play that scenario again with a little bit of practice. But uh, there you go. Nice looking game. Do you prefer this over trains? Matt, thank you very much for the $5. I'm not sure what I would select. I'd, I, 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 would, I would definitely say both of them are great. David Scott, that is the third time with that message. One more and we'll have to time you out, man. Come on. Nobody's immune. Come on, dude. Thank you very much, Papa Pom. Jeez, man. We get it, guys. Come on. Okay. So we did an American passenger train. I have yet to beat that one. I'm good. Raptor's good at slow speed. That's that's my top speed is slow speed. So we'll have to come back and complete. So we completed Trash Collector, no problem. City Sprinter, we're gonna have to gonna have to master that one. All right, let's go on to some English trains then, right? So we've done some American passenger and some uh, American cargo. Let's do the Great Western Express. What do we have here? Uh, down the line, Christmas closures looks like the shortest one. All we gotta do is go from point A to point B and then stop where we need to. Okay, let's do this mission. Also, I don't know what's going on with the, uh, with the, um, uh, like voice acting. There's, n I haven't heard anybody do any voice acting yet. Maybe it, maybe it tripped out or something like that. There should be voice. Oh, there it goes. Uh, thanks, Kinsha. Nice looking game. Do you prefer it over City Skylines? I like City Skylines. Thank you, Kinsha. Are we gonna have to get on that train? Oh, we're going over here. Yeah, so for the United States, there's, uh, I think there's somewhere out west, and then there's the Northeast Corridor near New York, and then there's, uh, the GWR for the Brits, and then the German S-Bahn. New subscriber shout-out. Nader, thank you very much for subscribing. Yeah, it's uh, Christmas season, so there's snow on the... It actually doesn't look that cold out. Oh, people actually are in jackets. I think we're, we're waiting for a train to pull up now. Oh, actually, I think this is our train. We're, we're just waiting to start our uh, our job now today. Bum, 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 bum. Hey, who left this open? Just for maintenance, I guess. So this is the train we're taking control of. I'm definitely going to have to have more practice with passenger trains. Though freight trains are probably the most enjoyable. Maybe we'll load some coal if we beat this one fast enough. We'll see. Uh, imagine if we could import city... Oh, that would be amazing. Yeah, if we could drive on our own uh, in-game railroad tracks. Oh, I would derail immediately. Yeah, have you seen my railroad? Okay, unlock carriage doors. Okay, unlock left. I need to learn where these buttons are on the controls, but it's better to do it for tab, I suppose. Ooh, and the sun's going down. Oh, it's like almost nine. Is that, wait, or is it going up? It should be going down. I mean, up. These trains are super, super comfortable to travel on. I do like these trains. We're just loading passengers now. Carriage doors are open. Doo, 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 doo. So I need to do a little bit better of knowing when to stop. But I, I also wish, you know, I, I wish since I'm kind of like a noob in training that it would tell me exactly where I needed to stop and stuff like that, you know? But yeah, you're, you're, you guys are right. It would be so cool to drive your own buses in your own cities and city skylines or in uh, 
in this game too. Drive the train lines. Okay, objective complete. I'm assuming we're gonna lock doors, disengage the brake. Uh, driver's buzzer. Confirm guard signal. I, I get what? Guess that's the confirm. Somebody's actually in the train. Uh, let's see. Set to forward here. There we go. And release brake. And notch two. And there we go. We're pulling away. Are we supposed to blow our horn in this game? Or in this train? Do British trains blow their horn? Request to pass signal at danger. I don't know what that is. I don't even know if we have to... I'll have to remember the rules for each... Uh, nation's trains you don't have to blow your horn? okay alright so it's around Christmas time we're now heading towards uh, Ealing Broadway and we're gonna proceed 12 miles to our next destination so I did great with the American freight train I, I'm really happy with my performance there uh, the only time I goofed up was like reading the the map where I was trying to learn. I I didn't know you could actually change uh, change the uh, junctions and such and f throw the switches from the map and also from the um, like from the third person camera mode. So that was really helpful. And then as for that last train, that was <laughs> I'm gonna need some practice, chat. But that's why we're here. So thanks for tuning in, folks. Again, if you're new here, make sure you click that subscribe button. And also, what would be really cool is for some new people to follow me on Instagram. I actually uh, drive tanks and some other things in real life, too. So if you want to see literal battle tanks being driven, we're talking about Challenger tanks. Well, not Challengers, but Chieftains, German tanks, American tanks, and everything else. Make sure you go ahead and check that down below in the description uh, and also there in the chat. And then, yeah, just shouting out a uh, quote play and then game title is nothing. I, I won't respond to that. Right now we're, we're playing this game, so thanks for tuning in for it. Appreciate having you here. So I guess we just get, get to coast along for a couple miles here. Very nice. What state do I live in? Uh, Minnesota. I live in a state of self-loathing. <laughs> Mindset-wise. State of constant self-betterment. I gotta say, though, I'm not as convinced with the, uh, the snow on this one. The train is too clean for it being, you know, the winter season. It, it should be dust with snow. It should be gross and wet and you know how it is, like, some, most of the problem with snow in winter is not about the snow. It's more about, like, when the snow kind of turns to slush and water and stuff like that. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Well, this is a nice, relaxing train ride. I'm actually planning on going to uh, Japan very soon, and we're going to drive on some uh, Japanese bullet trains, so we'll see how fun that goes. Shin Shinkansen, I think? Shinkansen? Something like that. Ooh, pretty. Farm fields to our left and right. Gorgeous. Do, 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 do. Oh, you're going to go to Japan in September? I'll be in October, I think. That'll be fun. Alright, so I think at some point we will have to stop on this route. 
So it won't be just a straight line from here to our destination. You can feel the cold? Oh boy. Oh my goodness, Kinsha. Thank you very much for the support. You have a tank in real life? A Resvani tank? I love driving down the road and someone sees the tank in the rear view mirror. Some people want to buy a house. I bought a car instead. Wow. Thanks again for your support. Oh, Kinsha, no way. You're spending Christmas and New Year's in Japan? Do you have, are you ordering KFC chicken for Christmas? And maybe you could do it for New Year's too, I suppose. I don't know if they do it at the same time, but apparently that's a very Japanese thing to do is to uh, order KFC around Christmas. They already have uh, fried chicken. The Japanese, for the longest time, have had their own ancient recipe of uh, chicken. And um, when KFC kind of started selling chicken in Japan, all the Japanese p people went crazy to like celebrate Christmas, even though they don't. It's more of a winter thing, but that's really cool. Thanks again for the support, Kinsha. All right, well, we're doing 103, so we've now broken 100 miles an hour, the fastest we've gone in our live stream on a train. Our max speed here is uh, just under 120, I think. I think that might be our max, or at least we'll probably just hit that before we reach our destination. Beautiful bridges and tunnels. Let's take a look from external view. Shame you won't be there. We could have met up in Akihabara. That's all right. There's always next time. If I enjoy it enough, I'll be back for more. Thanks again, Kinsha, for the support. Yes, that's right. Uh, the J-Rail Pass. Make sure you order that ahead of time, right? They send you a uh, thing in the mail, and then you have to turn it in when you get there. Too bad they, they need to have Japan in here. What's the other DLC d that I don't have? People were saying that there's there should be another DLC that I should have. Apparently I've seen some old steam trains that are available on this one that move cargo at very slow places, or uh, short distances and uh, like terminals. Okay, we're getting green lights everywhere. Yeah, I really wanted... Oh, a new German DLC coming out. Oh, yeah, for cargo. I totally want to go to France. I'd love to do some Italy, Switzerland, Austria. I'd love to do the Alps. Uh, that would be awesome. Like, trains through there. That would be amazing. I really am hoping that this game becomes a lot more... Um, a lot more. I, I don't know what to say other than that. I really like this so far. I mean, I could totally stream this, like, once a week. I'm going to do it every couple of days, though, because I like it. I'm going to do this again tomorrow, too, keep in mind. Okay, well, our destination is less than three miles out. Oh, we haven't had to stop on this one. This one was way easier than the American one. Raptor is just very bad at reading uh, signs. Yeah, this in VR. You know, um, this with uh, track IR would be nice. You like my voice? Well, thank you. Well, I like chat when chat's nice and calm. You guys are being real chill now. I like when everyone's just focused on what we're doing and just relaxed. That's what we're all here for is just to have a nice relaxing stream. Alright, we're about a mile out, coming in at uh, 100 miles an hour. Not that one. How am I supposed to know what the next speed is, though? <laughs> we're not making this one. Oops. This is full break. We're going to blow past the station. But at least I got here without uh, hitting another train or breaking any rules. Okay, if you're exiting now, everybody uh, jump out the left side of the train right now. Okay, bye. Enjoy your holidays.
Okay, great. And we're not supposed to go past this line, so we'll fail. Wow. The braking, bro. Whoo! That is going to be a long one. Holy crap. That would have that break down forever. I done goofed, yeah. You're definitely getting this game? Good. I would love to see uh, Japan. Uh, apparently there's more Germany, a few other things. But uh, there you go. Uh, let's see. Yeah, but the speed isn't necessarily indicated there. Otherwise, I would have done the speed. I didn't expect to pass that one either, but that one was good. You always fail that one? That's okay. Good thing is we can do it again anytime. Okay, well, we have some time left, folks. Shall we load some coal? Shall we do that? I've dishonored the Japanese rail company. Luckily, we were in Britain, so apparently that happens all the time. Oh, Russia would be cool, too. Oh, man. There's so many opportunities here. Uh, you don't own the West Somerset Railway. Okay, let me tab out, actually. And I wanna ch I'm want i going to take a look at the DLCs for this game because I'm totally interested in buying more DLC. I'm going to just... Uh, actually, wait. i got to tab out completely to go to the... Eh, I'll do it later. All right, what are we doing next? Oh, yeah, let's load up some... Uh, Shall we load up some coal, or should we do, or should we do the aggregate haul? I need to beat one. The passenger, sir, that one that we just did, I should have totally completed that one, but that thing stops like it takes forever. Discharge of rake hoppers at the Hayes Tarmac facility before working the train over to Act Acton Yard and preparing for the next journey to West County. Oh, we're not even hauling in that case. Technical issues. Oh, I got. I, oh, you got to haul it. Oh, that's cool. This one makes you haul a. Uh, uh, like a down train back to the terminal. Now that's cool. That's really cool. Alright, well let's see. We've done American cargo, we've done American trains. I think I'm going to try that American, uh, I'm going to do that American Amtrak scenario again. Let's, let's, come on. Cheer, cheer me on, chat. We're going to do this. We did American cargo just fine. New subscriber and, uh, channel. I've already recorded some of the coal episodes too, by the way, so stay tuned for that on the channel, but I'm not, I'm not done here without doing this one again. This one we're going to do again. Well, coal's pretty easy. You just basically do two miles an hour uh, to load all the coal cars, and then you just back it up and then connect to another train, and that's it. It's exciting, but it's not its not anything too crazy. Okay, let's, uh, we're going to do this one again. I got this. All the other times were practice. Although I would argue that this one is a little bit more difficult than the British one. Like, the British one is basically get her up to 125 coast and then come to a stop it's almost like those uh you guys remember gran turismo or any driving game where uh there's the brake test where it's like you know go 100 miles an hour and then stop within the indicated zone and you got to stop before you hit the cones that's essentially what that is but yeah we got this just uh it's a lot different slowing down from 100 miles an hour with a different train all right we're doing this one all over again we're going for perfection this time oh my god is that Oh, that's, uh, what's his name? Howie Mandel? Can I shake your hand, Howie? Can I shake your hand? Can I touch your hand? Howie? 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 Okay. Do, 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 do. Okay. Now open doors right. Do, do, do. If I press shift tab, it opens up Steam. But that's not what I'm looking to do. I want to open the store. If you press shift tab on Steam, it doesn't it doesn't bring up the store. It just brings up like your your friends and stuff. But that's okay. I'm happy to be practicing live with you fine folks. Pinto, you ever been on this train? Newark Liberty International Airport air train? Do oh, we're ready to go. All right, let's get out of here. Uh, let's see, lock right doors, reverse here to forward, disengage auto brakes, and apply and honk. Why isn't that a horn? There we go. Ah, I just like doing it. Oh, some of you have already been on this one? Yeah, that was a dank howie for sure. Okay, so. The goal is to stop 
at each one of those uh, markers perfectly and then not to go past that one point. I think this is actually way more difficult than the uh, previous one, but I don't think the game puts them in any sort of order of difficulty. I think it's just basically some scenarios are longer than others, but they're not overly impossible. Oh, look at that, the Amtrak logo right there. All right, we're doing this run again. But practice will make perfect, especially with braking. Accelerating, no problem. Braking, that's that's the thing. That's what you got to watch out for. Do, 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 do. And again, if you guys are liking what you're seeing, make sure you go ahead and hit that like button. And for those of you who haven't, there's the uh, Instagram link in chat. Thank you for following me, folks, for some uh, cool pictures of real-life fun and adventure. Well, the Amtrak uh, passengers might not have to jump out. They'll just have to, like, uh, they'll just have to, like, crawl onto the station because I'll be, like, stopping sh to either short or long of it. But the British passengers should have jumped out. I mean, they should have known. I mean, they knew I was driving. I mean, am I right or am I right? You know what would be interesting in this game, too, is if you could do uh, failures where you could just you could make your own route and then you could plan for a random failure like a fire and then just be able to, uh, you know, like negotiate how to, you know, bring the train to a stop and get all the doors open or something like that so people can bail out. Yes, the Amtrak is a government rail uh, system. Whoa, you really got to slow down here. The station comes up real fast. Still getting the hang of it. And I think the uh, U.S. trains are probably the hardest to drive, the U.S. passenger trains. And last time I stopped right on the, the beacon, but it didn't... I'm going to go past it a little bit, because otherwise I don't think it'll trigger. Okay, there it goes. So we do need to pass it a little bit. Because last time I was short and it freaked out. Alright, now we'll work on our braking in the next turn. Do, 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 do. New trains that are not out yet is the DBBR185143 and cab car. Hi, Uthris. Good to see you here. Playing a game called Train Sim World. Unfortunately, no Japanese trains, but there are German, British, an American for the Northeast Corridor. You may have actually been on this train before, Uthris, maybe. That's the Amtrak for the NEC. Oops, didn't mean to do that. There we go. Alright, wait till 7.05 to depart, and we're at... Well, I guess we're supposed to have the door open still, technically, but everybody uh, is loaded. Uh, I don't think it's multiplayer, but if it, if it was, oh man. Maybe it is, I don't know. It's coming, apparently, according to chat. Brake release, and master controller to A3. And... Brake is released, independent brake released. Alright, we should be rolling. This train is very slow to get started.
Boy, is it ever slow. Jeez. Should I just full throttle it? That just could be dangerous. Zero amperage, why? Brake release, independent released. Hmm. Am I new to this game? Uh, yes. I'm very good at the uh, freight, but passenger service is where I'm really starting to practice a bit on. You think I'm on idle? No, it's set to T-Max. Unless the game somehow didn't register that. Maybe it's just really slow to go. I don't. I don't know. Master controller is on T max. I'm not getting any amperage though. Brakes are off. Doors are locked. Hmm. Yeah, something doesn't seem right. Did I miss a step? Automatic brake is on release. Independent brake is on release. Controller is at max. Hmm. Passenger brake mode. Hmm. It's because I have the the bell shouldn't limit speed, does it? I must have missed something. Let's put it back to idle. Alerter cutout. ATC, yeah, what the? Put brakes on, then off. I did try that. Well, now we're actually rolling at a speed. What, what, that was so strange. There must be some real heavy passengers, I guess. Weird. Oh well, practice will make perfect. It thinks I have the emergency brake on? Well, brake is set to release. Independent brake is set to release. Huh. Eh, yeah, well. Well, thank you very much, Kinship, for the support. Put the brakes on and off. Yeah, we tried that. Train's pulling a lot of weight. I d it's just passenger cars. New subscriber shout out. Recon Hunter, thanks for subscribing. Unfortunately, I can't answer your question, though, because it's related to another game title, and you spammed it twice. So, unfortunately, I can't do that. Sorry, my man. We have to discourage that, otherwise it becomes kind of just a... Re it People don't focus on the game that we're actually playing on. It's it's It just becomes like a, hey, when are you... It's, it's like a chat room about when are you going to play the game I want you to play. And the answer is, I guess, whenever I play it. And that answer doesn't change because New I guess the video never out. comes out until it's actually out. Ethan, thank you very much for subscribing. Alright, we do need to stop up here because this is the problem I, I had before. We'll see. There's our train. It's okay, Recon Hunter. Don't worry. Just keep in mind, I get asked, uh, shout out. when are you going to play blank game about 200 times a day, so it just makes me a little, a little crabby. New subscriber shout out. Well, welcome to all the new subscribers, though. Appreciate that. Yeah, I can't wait to see the... Also, Uthras, we did a horrible thing. We did all that planning, and then we totally, to totally, totally forgot to, like, link up on flights. Or at least the one flight. We'll have to talk because I now I got to make sure I got to check. We'll we'll talk, and then I'll yell at Pinto for that. It'll make me feel better. This is kind of like the train in City Skylines, isn't it? It would be nice. Is aren't there mods in City Skylines for different trains? I think there are. You can have like uh, diesel electric trains. I think it's just electric in the game, but as a standard. But it would be cool to 
do different things. Yeah, it's okay with us. I take responsibility for it, my man. Okay, we're having to slow down. Problem here is that it, it just shows yellow, which means you're slowing down, but I don't know to what. Am I slowing down to 30, 10, 0? I, like, I don't know. I'm just going to do 50 until I know, like, what we're doing here. I think we're slowing down to come to a stop. But I, I don't know. I'm hesitant. Are there, mon um, are there uh, animals in the game? Uh, no, I don't think so. Return flight? Uh, no. We'll talk. And that is really cool. I do like how the camera saves where you were looking before. That is helpful to just quickly look behind you if you want to. And then set it back to first person mode. Alright, yellow signal, next is red. The trouble here is I, I'm, I need to look uh, out for, uh, you know, I need to know what train, like how, how fast do I go, when do I stop. Train's a bit rough. You know, if you're not, if you're directly next to the train, it's great. Um, if it's, if you're looking off like more than four city blocks, it, yeah, it is. There are some areas where there's just no detail at all. Although you can see a church over there. Is that a church tower way off in the distance? I will right, we'll set things back to idle. Uh, but if anything, the, the details of the actual train are gorgeous. Okay, so there you go. There's the signal flashing yellow. Okay, now we're down to 62, so I made the right decision there. Slow down to the point of being able to stop at the next signal. I'm not sure how long this train takes to stop. I think a lot of this is going to have to be by feeling, which is how a lot of people, you know, drive and know how to shift gears and things like that, is just by the feeling of the of the actual vehicle. You know, how, how fast is it going, that kind of thing. Am I late? That's okay. We're just we're trying to not uh, not crash at this point. It's a lot easier to watch, I think, than it is to play, because you don't have to constantly adjust speed. Though I will say my, f my favorite so far is the cargo, but I think my real favorite when I master it will be the passenger trains. Uh, can you walk into the passenger cars? Yes, you can. You can uh, get up and walk out of this uh, cabin if you want to and go... Well, I, actually, I don't think you can walk back to the passenger cabs, but... Oh, there we go. Now we know we have to stop. All right, so let's brake. Well, wait a minute. Now, before I didn't have to... Now we're pulling into a station that I didn't have to pull into before. Now I'm like using the emergency brake because I don't know what else to do. Before we had to stop before we got to this station, so it must be all based off of time. I bet there's another train in front of us then that we need to... Uh, there must be another train in front of us that we're, we're trying to stay behind. So since we're not that close to it, these are probably running on a circuit, that kind of thing. Alright, let's roll up to this next one. And again... We do know that it's probably best to pass the marker than to be short of the marker. So that's one thing we've learned too. But practice will make perfect. All right, let's bring it to full service. And open the doors. Yay! Well, at least we made it here without failing. Actually, wait, weren't we supposed to make it here by 7.15? Am I right on time? Do 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 do. <coughs> Hi Kyle, how's it going there, man? All right, we're gonna get to the end of this route and see if we can make it. If I complete this one, I think it's been a successful stream. Uh, first of all, the goal here was to have a lot of fun and to uh, learn something new, and I've definitely done both. I'm going to master those British trains. And I think the most difficult so far has probably been the American trains. They're very heavy and slow to get started, but they seem to be relatively easy to stop. As with the German ones, are a little of the opposite. German trains are uh, very fast uh, to get going, and then they take a little bit of time to slow down. Like, you want to keep coasting, 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 and then, like, come to a gradual stop. So it's a lot different than the American trains. Okay, New York Penn at 25. Back to idle. 
Release. Well, go. Oh, look at how fast we're accelerating now. There must have been a glitch at that other station because look at how fast we're going now. Before, at the other station, we were just zeroed out. I couldn't, I couldn't go any faster. We must have did something, but now, now we're rolling. Can you jump out the train while moving? I think so, but if you do that, or you want to jump out the window, go for it. Kind of cool all the audio changes, isn't it? Yellow signal is a t uh, train two signals ahead of you. Red is the train at the next signal. Okay, so that's us trying to keep our distance. So let's just go ahead and chill out at like 29%. We should be okay. We should be okay. So it's not about us coming to a stop. It's about us getting cl too close to another train. Gotcha. Hmm. Okay. Good learning experiences. Well, if there's a train in front of us, then I don't want to go too fast. Actually, this one's red, isn't it? Wait, do I have to stop here? What's the deal? I'm not failing this again. To hell with that. What, what the... F <laughs> I, I'm not sure. We're late, but there's still a train in front of us? I don't know about that one. I was trying to come to a stop, but it'll take some practice to understand. I don't know all the rules of, you know, driving a train, so it'll it'll take some time, but that's okay. Yes, red means stop, but what I need to know is, obviously that, that, that I understand, but what I need to understand is, like, what, do, what does that mean? Why, why are we stopping? Is there a train up ahead that's, like, coming the opposite direction that needs to use a different track, or what, what, is the, what is the case? I'll have to practice a little bit more. One thing I will say, though, is that the tutorials in this game are very, very basic. Like, they give you an introduction to two trains, and that's it. They don't, they don't necessarily, uh... No, that's not exactly what it means. Yellow doesn't mean put on brakes for a stop ahead, because we saw several yellow signals before we got to a station, and then it never it never turned red. So that's like that. There's no pure indication that you're going to be coming to a permanent stop. Can you be hit by a train? Uh, you can get in trouble for walking on the tracks all the time. But that's okay. I will say though that uh, off offline, I'll I'll complete these scenarios because it just takes a little bit of fine tuning. But we'll just go ahead and say City Sprinter is done for now meaning I won't play that one again on the channel. And same with the uh, Great Western Express, because all you really got to do is stop. So we'll uh, we'll see about that. All right, everyone. Well, that is my time here for tonight. So I appreciate you all coming in with your tips and tricks. And don't worry, practice will make perfect for me on this one. I'm really excited to go on to uh, do some more driving in Germany and also uh, Great Britain. So I think next time we'll do some uh, uh, European driving. We'll go, we'll go uh, do some passenger service in Germany, and we'll do some cargo services in Great Britain. And then if there's any other DLCs, I'm totally getting them. I really like that a lot. And then we'll do some more CSX heavy haul. Some some coal hauling. That type of thing should be pretty easy, so we'll do that. All right, folks, thank you very much for your attention tonight. Thank you very much for your help and your love and, and uh, all your helpful tips and positivity. Appreciate that. So I thank you for all of your time, and I appreciate you all being here. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe. If you haven't already, join us. Click, t click or tap that join button. Appreciate that. Uh, yeah, I, I, this was a real fun stream. I enjoyed it. I'll be doing this again tomorrow, so uh, stay tuned for more, uh, you know, me overshooting the station and, and uh, you know, going way too fast and hitting other trains. But I'm going to learn. I'm going to learn this game. This is definitely going to be a good time. All right, I will see you all next time. Thank you, everyone. Take care. Have a good evening. That was weird. All right, take care. Have a good evening. I'll see you next time. Bye, everyone. Let's see if we can find some good tunes to go out on. Let's try. Let's do this one. Gangster.